in it. Um, wine is actually a symbol of happiness. And I want the joy of your lives to be sweet and full, as I know they really have been, but to continue so. And just to hold this now, take a little sip. We'll pick up her veil for a minute. And I want to say the bracha, Baruch Atoranoi, Eloheinu Melech Olom, Borei Pri Hagafen, Amen, which means, Blessed art thou, O Lord our God, King of the universe, who have given us the fruit of the vine. Okay. Good. That's it. Yeah, we need that for the wind. And at this time, I'm going to ask you to take and recite your vows just like you did 65 years ago today. Do you, Leo, take this woman, Marion, to be your wife, to live together in holy matrimony, to love, honor, comfort her, and keep her in sickness and in health, forsaking all others as long as you both shall live? I do. And Marion, do you, Marion, take this woman, this man, <laughs> to be your husband, <laughs> to, to live together in holy matrimony, to love, honor, comfort him, keep him in sickness and in health, forsaking all others as long as you both shall live? Yeah, maybe. Let me think about it. <laughs> okay. Okay. I want you to hold. I want you to hold hands, okay. and then I want you to say, "I, Leo." I, Leo. Take you, Marion. Take you, Marion. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer. For richer, or poor. I'm still waiting for the money. <laughs> we'll just stick to the richer. We don't want the poor, huh? For sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. And you, Marion, repeat after with me. I, Marion. I, Marion. Take you, Leo. Look at Leo. Take you, Leo. Take you, Leo. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold tight. <laughs> from this day forward, for better or worse. From this day forward, for better or worse. <laughs> for richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. <laughs> in sickness and in health. In sickness and health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. And at this time, I'm going to have our little svelte ring bearer come up. <laughs> you see, that's it. The that, ring is too heavy for him. I know. I know. Wait, hold on. I'm going to explain that number one in the Jewish tradition, it requires, truthfully, that verbal declaration of betrothal be accompanied by the transfer of something of value. Most ceremonies naturally do the rings, and that's what we chose for today. Traditionally, only the women receive the ring as a symbol of acquisition by the groom. However, in modern times, it changed. The women wanted everyone to know that that man was a married man, so that's how it became the symbol of the rings. So at this time, we're going to have you give the ring. We're going to do the, he, the, give the woman's ring to Leo first. This guy's collapsing. I hope nobody took the ring. All right, we've, these have been borrowed rings, all right? Borrowed. Borrowed rings, okay. And I want you to place the ring on, his fi on her finger and to repeat the following. I give you this ring as a token. I give you this ring as a token. And pledge of our cost, constant faith. And I pledge my constant faith. And abiding love. And abiding love. And now put that on her finger. And now svelte ring bearer with the toilet paper streamers. <laughs> Let's give the ring over to Marion to <laughs> give to her groom. <laughs> yes, you can sit down, svelte ring bearer. <laughs> and at this time, we're going to have Marion say, I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a token and pledge. As a token and pledge. Of our constant faith. 
of our constant faith. An abiding love. An abiding love. And now I want you to repeat with me. Yes. With this ring. With this ring. I thee wed. In love, in love and, truth, and truth, and all my worldly goods, and all my worldly goods I thee endow. And, I do endow. and you say, with this ring, with this ring I, thee wed, I thee wed, in love and truth, in love and truth all my worldly goods, all my worldly goods I, thee endow. I thee endow. And by the virtue invested in me, I now pronounce you officially man and wife. And let's pick up her veil for a moment. And you can kiss the bride. Wait, wait, we're not, we're not finished. Also in the Jewish religion, we have a tradition known as the breaking of the glass. And I like to say that life is very fragile and may be shattered at any moment. And with the breaking of the glass, I also like, there's a lot of little what we call stories about it. One that I like a lot says that by the breaking of the glass, we're going to break any evils that would come upon the husband and the wife and the bride and groom. So that's one of the reasons. And then it also is to commemorate and remember the destruction of the temple and of thousands and thousands of people years ago that were killed. So at this time, and I don't think that truthfully, Leo, this is really going to be the last time you're going to get to put your foot down anyway, because you had enough over the years. And let's see if you got enough strength. Hold on. So everybody can see. Whoops. See if you can. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, here we go. This is for our traditional breaking of the glass. Let's see. Put your foot down for the last time. I didn't hear. There we go. Muscle talk. All right. Let's see. Official Mr. and Mrs. Goldner for 65 years. And Mr. and Mrs. Goldner, turn around. Turn around. We're going to have Mr. and Mrs. Goldner exit through the arches. Let the family exit through the arches. And then please, all of you, exit through the arches. We're going to bring you around to the front of the building where you'll pick up your little place cards for your table. We thank you for attending our ceremony. Mr. and Mrs. Leo Goldner, ladies and gentlemen. Cheers for the rabbi. <laughs> nice job. Thank you for Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.
is my wife Lynn, and you know her for many years, and uh, we decided to come in and honor you.